Hey, what's going on everybody? It's JBob here and today we are in Minecraft Bedrock Edition and I have a quick little tutorial on how you can join custom servers. I'm actually making this video because later this week I'm going to be launching my very own Minecraft Bedrock custom server called StupidCraft. It's going to be a survival based server in vanilla Minecraft and it's going to be open for all of you guys to join and I'm actually super super excited about it. It has been a long time in the works and uh, I wanted to make this video to kind of show you guys how to join custom servers so that way when I launch my server all of you guys will be ready to go and I can refer people back to this video if they need help. But uh, yeah, if you guys are interested in my server or want to know more about it, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and uh, hit the little bell icon so you guys are notified when that video goes live later this week. But without further ado, let's get into the tutorial. So first things first, if you guys are actually playing on other mobile MCPE or the Windows 10 edition of Minecraft Bedrock, you're pretty much already ready to rock and roll. Here's a clip of me on my Windows 10 version of Minecraft Bedrock. And as you see, if you just go over to your servers page, there's a big button at the top, which allows you to then add a server. All you gotta do is click that, and then you're able to type in your server's information, and uh, then you're pretty much ready to go. That will be added to your servers list, and you can have a great time playing on that server. So this video is mainly just going to be for those of you who are playing on other Xbox, Nintendo Switch, or PlayStation, um, where that add a server button isn't there. So as you see here, I am on my Xbox, and if we go over to our servers page, we just have our featured servers here. There's not a add server button, and there's really not a way to add any custom server so I'm gonna basically today walk you through how to add custom servers to your your servers list now I just want to quickly say that I learned how to do this with this method from another youtuber by the name of Dacon Black Rose he's a really great Minecraft youtuber and he does all sorts of different tutorials and um, he's a very 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 smart guy when it comes to Minecraft things and doing things within Minecraft So if you guys are interested in any of that, I'll have his channel linked down below now This tutorial is actually going to be done on Xbox But if you guys on PlayStation or Nintendo switch uh, will just follow along uh, I'm sure that that your devices will have similar settings to these so if you just try and follow along and kind of look for the same settings options uh, You should be good to go, but this is going to be for how to do it on Xbox but basically what you want to do is once you're in your settings, you want to come here in your general to your network settings, and then you want to go into your advanced settings. And here is your where you're going to be changing your DNS settings. Now, I know that sounds kind of scary, changing your settings, but basically what you're going to be doing is basically changing it from the automatic to the manual and typing in some numbers here. And this really won't mess with any of your, your games or anything like that if you're, you're playing online with other games or anything like that. But if you guys, for some reason, do want to change this back in the future, all you have to do is change it from manual back to automatic. But once you are here in the manual settings, you're going to type in these numbers here. 1, 0, 4, 2, 3, 8... One, three, zero, and one, eight, zero. And now you're going to type in these secondary numbers, which are literally just eight, 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 and eight. Just four eights across the board. And then once you get that, your settings will be changed. And then you should get a little thing that says all good. You can go back and then you should be ready to head back over to Minecraft. So I'm going to quickly just restart my Minecraft real quick. So that way it gets all the setting information changes. And now that we are back loaded into Minecraft, you're going to actually head over to your servers page. And as you can see, nothing yet has changed. But what you want to do is just find any of these featured servers and click on them. So I'm going to choose Mineplex. And as you can see, once you join the server, a little menu will pop up. And this here is that menu. Now, as you see here, you still have all of the featured servers. So if you wanted to play on any of those, you can do that by clicking them here. But then you also have the option to connect to other servers, other custom servers. So basically, 
All you have to do is enter in your server's IP here and uh, change the port if that's required. Most servers use this same port, the 1913.2 port, but um, some of them have different ones. So keep an eye out for that if uh, the server you're trying to connect to has a different port. Now you can also go ahead and click this little switch here, which will add it to your server list, which is the screen we are just on. So that way you don't have to type in the IP every time. But yeah, you guys can basically just enter in the uh, the IP address here and you're ready to uh, submit and rock and roll. Now, I'm actually not going to be joining any servers today because um, my very own server is launching again later this week, which I'm super hyped about. And uh, I'm going to wait until then to give you guys the, uh, the IP address to join it. So I hope this tutorial helped some of you guys out there today. And um, yeah, I hope this all, this all worked for you. But if you guys do have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments or uh, reach out to me on, uh, on Discord. But guys, I think that is going to be everything. Yeah, I'm, I'm super hyped for this custom server I'm about to be launching, guys. I hope to see a lot of you guys on there. So uh, again, hit that little bell, bell icon so you're notified when that, when that video goes live. You know what I mean? Because it's going to be freaking hype. All right, guys. <laughs> I'll see you next time. J-Bob, out. Oh, <laughs>